Hello everyone, let's get straight to the point. I know many of you have faced this kind of error. Today we will learn how to fix this error and within this two minutes I'm gonna finish this up. Just hang on. First of all you need to go to the search option and that is on the left hand side of your screen. Type there register edit in a short form. That means you need to type reg. So click on the register edit that is displayed on the upper side of your screen. Right click and run as administrator. After that close this search option. Now you will see the register edit dialog box. Here you have to export the register file so that if anything gets corrupted in your register you can just import the default register file from the desktop that you have backup already. For now I will give the location to the desktop and I will save the file to the desktop. It will take some time more than a minute or two minutes. My backup is finished and if you get any problem or error by editing the register edit in this way you can import the default file that you have backup in the desktop. Moving on to the main part now. Go to the add key current user. After that click on the control panel and then go to the desktop. Now what you need to do is right click here at the right hand side on the blank side. Right click and click on new. Click on the string value and rename the file as a-u-t-o-e-n-d-t-a-s-k auto end task double click the auto end task file and give the value as one and press ok close the registry dialog box and restart your computer and your error will be solved in this way you can fix the app shutdown issue if you have any queries regarding windows error follow me on instagram message me comment me and if you need any software follow me in also telegram Thank you very much for watching my video guys and if you really like my video do subscribe my channel and if you have any queries regarding about windows problems errors just follow me on instagram and message me thank you once again we will meet again in the next video